Sometimes we judge ourselves for caring about others' perception of us, but the truth of the matter is that these thoughts and concerns only point us in the direction of how to honor parts of ourselves we have neglected by waiting for others to love us there first. The love and recognition we have awaited from the world around us has always been available to us, only denied by the gatekeeper within. It's time to open the gates of love, compassion, and honor inside of our hearts and let it all flood into the spaces in our souls that we have tended to judge or view negatively or harshly. Today we take a step towards inner wholeness and self-love. This guided exploration is meant to help transmute energies and self-concepts that no longer serve us and strengthen and uplift the ones that do. Find a comfy, quiet space to participate in this healing experience. We begin now. Take three full deep breaths. Pull into focus the image or images of yourself that you often wish others to perceive you as. What energies, attitudes, feelings, and thoughts come to mind? Maybe the answer is different for each person that perceives you, each group of people. Allow yourself to be with these energies as neutrally as you can and let whatever wants to come up be seen and experienced. Take your time. Often what comes up is how you don't want others to view you, what you don't want others to see. A worry or concern, as if you fear that your true intentions and identity may not be seen by those you care about. What identities, qualities, or attitudes do you not want others to see? In what ways are you fearful that others will view you in these ways? What parts of yourself are you afraid to show others for fear of rejection or judgment? Now sit with these energies for a bit. What emotions are coming up around these concerns for how others might see you? Are you feeling inferior, uncared for, misunderstood? Tap into your heart space and allow any available emotion to come to the surface around these fears and worries. As each emotion arises, 
Begin to send feelings of unconditional love and compassion to these spaces in your heart, to the sources of these emotions. Even if this is difficult, just do the best you can. Even the awareness of these emotions is productive and healing. Take a few moments to do this. Now ask yourself how you can honor yourself in the ways that you have been fearing others can't. What parts of your soul are feeling neglected and unseen? Take a few moments to honor yourself by sending unconditional love and compassion to the most seemingly unlovable parts of who you are. Beautiful. Now we are going to tap into the ways in which you do wish others to see you. Do you want others to see you as lovable, loving, successful, honorable, funny, kind, caring, beautiful? Take your time to feel into this. What emotions come up when you tap into these qualities? Do you feel you are falling short of these idealistic viewpoints of who you are? Where are you judging yourself for wanting to be viewed in these ways? Take a few moments to ponder these questions and send unconditional love and compassion to the source of any judgments or negative feelings that are coming up around how you wish others to view you. Now tap into the aspects that have come up around the ways in which you hope others view you that have felt good. Can you feel successful, honorable, funny, kind, caring, or helpful on your own in a way that feels true to what makes your heart feel whole, what feels authentic to who you really are? Tap into your self-concepts and honor these parts of yourself as if they are already true, fully real without any necessity for outside recognition. Take a few moments to do so. You are honorable, lovable, whole, kind, caring, 
helpful, loving, and a very important person. All aspects of you are lovable, believe it or not. Inner recognition and honor is always only a little bit of self-love away. I hope you move through the world with a little more self-awareness and an expanded capacity for compassion and self-love. Thank you for showing up for yourself today. Place your hands in prayer position and bow in reverence to your lovable and honorable spirit and soul.